This is Jose, and you're about to embark on the next 10 minutes of my life. Are you ready? Hi. Hello. So whatever you have to do, go upstairs. This is one of my best chocolate friends ever. Coco His name kisses. is, this is April, and I love him to kisses. How are you? Yes, so he's my bestie. He's gonna be our, hopefully, our future roommate. So this is gonna be really exciting. It's gonna be so fierce for all three of us live together. I know. So good. We can actually do our dances and our practice. And there's open space right here. Hello, hello. Right, hello. you know, you can move these couches and bam, right here. Okay, okay let's do a demo if I look here. Coming out party right here. Yeah, it's like mm -hmm. Love this one. This one is fierce as fuck, and you should consider her. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. And this one right here. <laughs> Welcome to Daytona Beach. I mean Daytona. Welcome to Embry Riddle Aeronautical University. This is my school. Well, the back of it because they parked in the back lot. Um, that's some random building I don't know about. Here's the airport because we're an aeronautical university. So, we fly planes and stuff. I don't though, I'm an engineer. I like to stay on the ground. You know, I just started playing the piano for about, mm, I would say three, four months now. So, um, don't judge my crazy skills. <laughs> no, but you know, I play violin and I play cello and you know, I was trying to figure out how is there an easier way to incorporate both instruments together in um, composing music. So I was just like, you know what, I, I learned how to play the piano and, you know, I have some training. Well, not on the piano, but, you know, I know what it is and I know how it works. So it's up to me to basically put the practice together. But either way, I'll just play, I'll do a little bit of improvisation. I'll play a little bit of some stuff that I already, that I've been working on on my own. Don't steal my music. But, um, but yeah, I'll just give you guys a little bit of a taste of the things that I do. Right. <laughs>
say hello. Is this for when you're like a big celebrity and you want to remember the little people? <laughs> <laughs> little, little people. Rude. <laughs> Rude. This is Kat. She's one of my awesomest friends. She works here at Buckle as well with the other fierce and fabulous. See? Buckle B. Buckle B. Ugh, nothing better than getting a pedicure. Ugh, massage chairs feel so good. Yay. Look, your water changes color. Ooh, how exciting. My toesies. I'm Dr. Libby Searcy. Um, I'm director of the writing program and an assistant professor at Embry-Riddle. Also great. Um, I think the thing that I appreciate the most about Jose is his creativity, for sure. Uh, I, even before I, I saw his writing, I was aware of his other kinds of creativity. Um, he's phenomenal um, uh, at the violin and did some work for me, actually, in a film project um, that I was working on where he created and composed some uh, original um, piano. And uh, that was also gorgeous. Um, he's creative, just sort of himself as a text, right? And I, oh, I definitely appreciate that. Um, as far as the fashion sense, the um, uh, always sort of you know, trying to think outside the box um, in terms of creativity. Um, I appreciate how excited he gets about being creative in so many different ways, whether it's his music, um, his, his, uh, uh, his writing, even though I know that's something he did for a class. I know that um, that may not have been something he would do otherwise, but he was genuinely invested in it. Um, it's photography, which is also gorgeous. Um, I get a little taste of that on Facebook sometimes. Um, and even in, in that sort of thing, I think there's the appreciation of, um, uh, of image, of metaphor, of um, uh, representation um, in all different kinds of ways. And I think that um, he plays with that himself, even as a person. Um, and what is this... Um, what is this style of hair? What is this pair of shoes? What is this, you know, going to, uh, going to say? And how might that um, be part of expressing who I am? Um, uh, I think that um, Jose likes to um, push the boundaries, and I think he likes to um, be provocative, but in, you know, in in the best sense of that word, um, to provoke uh, thought and. Um, uh, and creativity in others, really. Thank you once again for allowing me to get this far with you guys and I really hope that you enjoyed the video and I hope to see you guys soon. Alright, bye bye.